Guys, Coach here with Plan of the Week. Hey, I thought I'd show you something just a little bit different this week. Uh, we all know about the full-size hydrangeas, you know, the, the panicle hydrangeas, the arborescence hydrangeas, the ones that get big that people and grandma had on the corner of the house. Well, introduce you this one, the Seaside Serenade, the Fire Island hydrangea. These are a dwarf hydrangea to three, three and a half feet, three and a half feet wide. So not super tall. This is great for a mid-size, mid-big planting bed. Something tall in the back, this one in the front, and something colorful down below. Seaside Serenade. Look at the, the double colored blooms that are just now starting to pop out. They have a pink and white tinge to them. Very, very colorful. Can handle a lot of sun. It can go up to almost three quarters of a day of sun depending on your situation. If you're in a southern or western exposure, I would suggest shade after 2 p.m., sun up until then. Try to keep it not uh, right up against a wall or reflective heat off the wall or windows. You'll tend to burn the tops of them. But if it's out in front of something and behind something like a three-tiered bed, fantastic, yeah. Seaside Serenade, Fire Island Hydrangea Collection. Check them out, grown by the Monrovia Company. So the next time you're at your garden center, look for the dwarf hydrangea. It might satisfy a situation that you have. Remember to feed it four times a year. Acid-loving fertilizer, and it does take pruning fairly well. Guys, I'll catch you next week. Seaside Serenade, check them out.